Good evening, teacher. Good evening, good evening. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, yeah, teacher. Good evening. Excellent. Good evening, How are you evening, today? Teacher. Good evening, teacher. Uh, all friends. Great. Excellent. I'm so sorry. I was just having issues with my um good evening, teacher. My headset's right, so but let's see. Hopefully I can fix it quickly here. All right, so we're about to start right now. Just give me one quick second. There you go. El grupo solo es, por el momento solo estaríamos nosotros, no estaría el link, jóvenes, pero hay tres que no los puedo incorporar porque no tienen nombre en el grupo. Así que si los identificamos. Sí, te da razón, fíjate, vaya a ser. Te ha un 10. Y no van a seguir pidiendo por eso. Esa conversación. Ahorita Weber, ahí es que agrega a los demás compañeros. El audio, el audio, Valle. The child. The child. All, All right. right. Let's see here. The microphone is on. Very good. Excellent. So I'm so sorry for this inconvenience. Let's just start right now, everybody. So I can say officially good evening to everybody I can see in the class. So let's see, Mr. Saul Martinez, Adam, Edith, Edmundo, Benjamin, eh, Magdalena, Monica, Santos. Good evening, everybody. All right. As I said before, I'm so sorry because I was having issues with my headset and my second device, but we are here. All right. So and we are going to start practicing here um, for tonight's class. Okay. Now let's just go ahead and continue here with the first activity, which is a tongue twister. Everybody, you can actually practice it. In um, making sure you focus on the sh sound, right? Take a look, take a look, take a look. This one right here, all right? So it says, pay attention, my friends. It says, she sells seashells by the seashore. The shells she sells are surely seashells. So if she sells shells on the seashore, I'm sure she sells seashore shells. That's easy, easy, easy. All right. So one more time, one more time. Let's see this one. So it goes, she sells, very good, seashells by the seashore. The shells she sells are surely seashells. So if she sells shells, on the seashore, I'm sure she sells seashore shells. All right, everybody. So we have here one minute for you to practice, practice, practice. All right. So we can start checking some volunteers. Right now, practice, practice. 
if you have questions, please tell me, all right? So let's see, let's see, let's see. Mm -hmm. All right, very good, very good. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So practice, practice, practice. In one minute, I'm going to ask for some volunteers, okay? One second here. Questions about the pronunciation? Uh, teacher, uh, see sure. Así es, se pronuncia. See sure. Oh, in the first line, the last word is see sure. Be sure. Sure, con O. Sure. Be sure. Exactly, see sure. Be sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, so let's see. Almost time, almost time. Everybody practicing, practicing, practicing. Questions, questions. This is the war. This? Seashore. She sells seashells by the seashore. The shells she sells are surely seashells. So if she sells shells on the seashore. I'm sure she sells seashore shells. Very good. Excellent. Awesome. 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 Very good. Thank you, Mr. Martinez, for sharing the seashore. This she sells thin toaster. Oh my god. I also got stuck here. All right, pronouncing this. Thank you. All right, everybody. Hey, time's up. Time's up. Time's up. Uh, you want me to repeat? What was the question? I'm sorry. What was the question? Sure. Yep. Uh, I like to to say the twister tongue. All right. Yes. Thank you. All right. Guess. Go ahead, please. She sells seashells by the seashore. The shells she sells are certainly seashells. So if she sells shells on the seashore, I'm sure she sells seashore shells. There you go. Excellent. Thank you very much for that one, Mr. Edmundo. All right. So good job. Thank you. Magdalena, please go ahead. Hello, Magdalena. We have audio issues. Okay, well, and okay, Magdalena and uh, arregla sus issues the audio. All right, so can you tell us any other volunteer? Me, teacher. Thank you, Mr. Martinez, Saul Martinez, right? Go ahead. Okay. She sells seashells by the seashore. The shells she sells are surely seashells. So if she sells shells on the seashore, I sure she sells seashore shells. Great job. Excellent. Thank you very much on this one, right? Really appreciate that one. All right. Thank you, my friend. Good job. Mr. Oja, amazing. All right. So go ahead. She shall, she shall, mm. Be the sure, the she, she sure, the she, she, she are surely, she, she, she sure, so of she, of if she, she, so, she, she, on the, she sure, she sure, I sure, she, so, Seashore shelf. Okay, very good. Excellent. Thank yes. you very much. Right. Oops. We move the next one. You shot the next part. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Who's going to be the next one? The next one up here. Iglesias, go ahead. Okay. She shall, she shall 
Sí. Bueno, casi un día. Sí, help. Ajá. By the seashore. The shell. She shell. Are surly. She she shells. So she shell. Shells. On the seashore. I'm sure she shell. Seashore shells. Excellent. Thank you very much. Very good job. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Who's the next one? The next one. The next one. Who is it? Who is it? Teacher. Who said me? Juan Francisco, right? Boy, boy. Emily, go ahead. She, she shall, she shall buy sure the shield, she shall are surely. She say, so I shall, shall, shall on the sure. I am sure she shall, sure, shall. Okay, very good. Excellent. Thank you very much. Right. So, well, we are going to stop right here with this activity. Vamos a tenernos hasta acá con esta activity. Uh, I don't know if I, if I have another volunteer before we continue. Another volunteer? No. Teacher, okay. me listen. Ah, ahora sí, my friend. Uh, she said. Que, wait, 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 wait. Magdalena, creo que tiene. Los micrófonos abiertos en dos dispositivos, no sé ahí. No, es que la computadora no sirve. Yo veo acá que tiene dos dispositivos. Quiero ver ahora. Hable Magdalena, please. Sí, es que tengo la computadora y el teléfono. Ok, excelente. So, veamos, pero ya lo muteamos de uno. So, no, no worries, go ahead. Démosle, go ahead, tiene She sells, she, she, she shall buy, buy the, she, she story. The shell, she sell are surely, she shall, so if she sells, she on the, on the seashore, I am sure she shall, She store chairs. Mm, excellent. Very good job. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for helping me with that one. Let's just continue with the next idea right here. Voy a desconectarme del teléfono, teacher. No voy a, a, a con, hablar con ustedes por ese problema que tengo. Disculpe, I'm sorry. No problem. Thank you for reporting it. Okay, excellent. So, well, let's just continue here with the next activity. So you can see it right now. Okay, there you go, the review, okay? So in this exercise right here, you have to pay attention to the exercise we're having here, which is gonna be this one. This is the verb, the verb, the verb, you have it here, right? And then you have to complete with this verb, the examples right here. Remember, ayer estuvimos viendo el future with the will, all right? So we are going to be using that one. For example, in here, it's going to be like this. So for example, aquí dice que, el verbo es be. ¿Cómo sería entonces here, the auxiliary? Is affirmative or negative? Uh -huh. This example is affirmative or negative? Affir affirmative. Affirmative, all right. So what is going to be after the subject? What is next after the will subject? The, the, will, the, the, will be. Will be. be back. That's it? Because back yeah. was already there, right? So it would be like... Uh, they will be back by 6.30 p.m. And that's it. Very good. Excellent. For the next one, the next one, it's a question. Do you remember what's the structure for the questions, my friends? Yes, teacher. Will you... mm -hmm. So it will, will be here. Will you, will you help me? Will, will you, help me? you help me? Sorry. All right. Would you help me like that? Thank you very much. So you go on the next one right there, my friends. The next one, it's also a question. What's going to be here? When will 
Adán, Adán, Adán. Buen el pasado mandante lucha. Buen Will, buen Will. Ay. Buen Will. Buen Will. Ay. Ay. I see. The bear. I, I see. see. See, see, see. Yep. All right. Okay. See you again. See. Exactly. Okay. Remember, right? Yeah. Aunque tengamos aquí el tú, a la hora de usar el will, dijimos okay. ayer que no lo íbamos a utilizar. Right? So, okay. very good. Thank you. Thank you. So, then, number four, it's negative. So, what will be here the structure, my friends, for this one, for the negative part right here? Want. Uh -huh. Want. So, his parents. Want. Want. And the bird. Punish. Punishing. Punishing for being late. Excellent. Thank oh, you very much. Okay. Right? Punish. So, the number Punish. five, it's a question. A castigo. A castigo. What is first in a question? Will. Will. Very good. Excellent. So, then we have this one. Will. Find it. Will they? Will. Sign. Will they sign? Sign, very good. The sign. contract. What is sign, my friends? Firmar. Yay. Will they sign the contract tonight? Very good. Excellent. So then we go with number six. Number six, it's an affirmative sentence, right? So what is going to be there, my friends? It will take. It will take. It very will good. Take. It will take. Thank you. All right. It so will we'll take. Uh -huh. It will take us three hours to get there. Very good. The number seven, it's a question, right? So how do we start with uh, the questions? Will. Will, very Bye. good. Rice. Will this concert? Rice. 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 All right. Excellent. Thank you. What about number eight? For number eight, we have a negative one. Hmm? So this band won't. This band won't. Won't break down. Break down. Won't break down. With a people in this. Okay. We can leave it like that. Won't break down with eight people in it. All right, very good. And then we have the number nine. Number nine, it's also a negative one. So yeah. the meaning won't won't close. Won't close. Exactly, right? So remember the verbos no se cambia. We don't change the verb, so we use the same, right? So then in the last one, it's also a question. What is the next the first word name? When? When? Will, will, will. Wheel, very good, like this one, All right? When wheel, uh huh, and the verb send, send. There you go, excellent. So, excellent, excellent, excellent. So, thank you guys, very good job in working with this review, you know, about the topic that we studied last night. All right, do you have any questions about vocabulary or the pronunciation of any word here in this exercise? On this exercise, I'm sorry. No question, teacher, for me. Okay, no thank you very much. The rest? No question. All right, very good, awesome. So let me just clean here so we can continue with the topic for today. All right, so the topic for today, it's just like this one. We will continue with uh, this. Siempre seguimos con el future, right? Aquí tenemos que dice, vamos a ver the wheel and going to in um as you can see here we have some differences here between the will and the going to uh, uh, like that one all right so and we continue saying like this one what is the difference yeah my friends do you know or do you understand what's the difference between a uh, going to and will si ambos son para futuro you know what's the difference <laughs> Yes. 
Do you know the difference between going to and will? Yes. What's the difference? Maybe uh, when you use uh, will, mm -hmm. just have a, have a plan. But when you use going to, is uh, you have the the you you are sure that this is going to happen. All right, very good, exactly. The grammar rule says that, right? So the grammar rule says that when you're using going to or use I mean, be plus going to, all right, you talk about uh, plans that you have decided on, right? So ya hay una decisión tomada al respecto. So you're saying just like, yes, I will. I'm sorry, like that one. And let's just go on the next one. En cambio, cuando es will, so it's just like you're talking about a possibility and maybe yes, maybe not. Ah, okay, in the usage, right? En el uso realmente no es tan grande la diferencia like in Spanish. So remember that, for example, in Spanish, you normally say like this one, for example, right? Like, yo comeré pizza. Or, yo voy a comer pizza. All right, excellent. So, ¿Cuál es en verdad la diferencia entre yo comeré y voy a comer pizza, my friends? Mm -hmm. mm, ¿Hay alguna diferencia? Is there any difference in this one? Yes or no? You are sure that it's going to, to eat pizza. Not really. Right. If you pay attention to this one, in español, no hay una gran diferencia en la intención, right? So, no. podemos usar una o la otra forma to express future. Yes or no? Yes. All right. So, then, in, in English, it's the same thing. I mean, both are for future, so we can use either or to talk about the future, of course, eh, depending on this one. But what we need to understand is que si voy a expresar la idea de haré, comeré, estaré, beberé, I'm going to use will. Or if I'm going to say, yo voy a, ella va a, nosotros vamos a, we are going to use going to. For example, says here, right? I will eat pizza. Or if you're going to talk about this one right here, it will be, I am going to eat pizza. There you go. And that's basically the differences right here. So as you can see it now, right? So uh, on this one, it's just like, yo comeré pizza. All right, so it's gonna be this one right here, which is, I will eat pizza. Yo voy a, it's a yo voy a, it's I am going to, like that. All right, so yo voy a, it's I'm going to. Luego comer pizza, eat pizza. That's basically the whole thing right here. Vamos a entender un momento, my friends. Do you understand at the moment? Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah, questions? Okay, no questions. Okay, very good. No Excellent. question for me. Well, let's just review something here quickly. All right. So, this one, it says, what's the chart, the future going to chart? All right. So, vamos a hablar como sería aquí lo negativo. I mean, lo, lo positivo, the positive. So, this is the structure right here. So, the future we're going to has this structure right here, right? So, in the first part here, we are going to talk about like the subject. The subject, which is, you know, I, you, he, she, it, we, they, etc. It's the first thing that we're going to use. Then we have on the next part right here. All right. So, las posibles contracciones. Es decir, esto que usted ve aquí. I'm sorry. I just made a mistake right here. There you go. Excellent. This is the positive. My bad. My bad. This is the correct one. All right, so, primero va el sujeto, les quiero decir aquí después, y luego usted puede utilizar, right, the verb to be en su forma normal, am, um, is, are, y fíjese bien con quién corresponde todo esto, right? So, for example, if you're talking about this one, estamos hablando de que el I, it's only with am. Um. All right, so, then, if you're talking about, like, he, she, and it, they use is. This is important, right? And then if you go with uh, we, you, and they, they're going to be using are. 
like this thing happens here, right? Good, 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 good. Excellent. So this is actually how you say it. Esto que usted ve acá, my friends, which is in uh, um, light blue, this one, son las contracciones de cómo se eh, abrevia o cómo se, contra se contracta eh, el verbo to be here. Entonces sería, puede ser I am o am. All right. It could be you are or your. He is or his. She is or she's. It is or it's. We are or we're. You are or you're. They are or they're. Okay. And after that, we automatically go with a going to. Going to is going to be exactly the same in this one. If you pay attention, there is a difference in the use of the um, structure here, the auxiliaries. It's like in el futuro, era un solo auxiliar para todo el mundo, right? Here, tengo que poner atención al verbo to be, que puede ser am, are, or is, y después going to, which is the same for everybody as well. Then, el verbo, the verb is going to be here in the base form. So, the verb doesn't change. May, watch, play, take up. A show, fix, book, a, or practice, right? So those are the verbs, so we don't change them at all, right? Vamos entendiendo cómo funciona esta structure. Are you understanding how this structure works? Yeah, teacher. All right, excellent. So, como diríamos esto, for example, here, if I want to say, I am going to make a cup of coffee, this one right here, it will be in Spanish, like, yo... Voy a hacer una taza de café. That's how you say this one, all right? And if you want to go here to the next one, which is number two, just like you are going to watch a few later. So there'll be like, eh, tú vas a ver la película después. Tú vas a ver la película después. So you watch a film later, all right? Y así vamos con el tú vas a watch. Exactly. So, for example, how do you say, my friends? Yo voy a ir al parque. How do you say that? I go, I'm going, I'm going to, to go to the park. I'm going to go. Ajá, muy bien. I'm going to go to the park. How do you say, yo voy a beber soda? I'm going to drink soda. I'm going to drink soda. Very good. Excellent. How do you say, ella... Va a ir a la fiesta. She's going to go to the party. She's going to go to the party. How do you say nosotros vamos a eh, estar en la fiesta? We are going to be at the party. Okay. Very good. Very good. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Do you have questions about this? No question for me, teacher. Okay, very good. What about the rest? Questions? No questions? No, no questions. questions. Okay, very good. Excellent. So, in that case, let's just continue here with the next part, which is now going to be the negative, right? So, now negative. that we have the negative structure there, so we are going to be, basically, it's the same, right? So, aquí lo que aparece es que hay dos tipos de contracción All right, so contracción en qué sentido que podemos hacer la contracción entre el sujeto y esto, que nos puede quedar siempre como I'm not All right, so, nos podría quedar de esta manera take a look, podría ser here I am not podría ser I'm not and that's it, ¿verdad? para, para I podría quedar de esta manera All right, so, then you go this one El siguiente quedaría, por ejemplo, he is not, he is not, or he isn't. You see this one right here? Solo la primera tiene dos formas, que es el I, all right? Los otros dos, o los otros sujetos, the other subjects, they have three different ways. Which is like, he is not, que sería sin contracciones, he is not. Aquí, contractando el sujeto y el verbo to be, Dejando la palabra not al final. Y aquí la contracción sería entre el verbo to be y el not. 
¿Cuál es la más común? The one you prefer. All right. So all of them are the ones that you prefer. All right. So questions. No questions. No question for me, teacher. All no right. Very good. Excellent. So thank you. Thank you. So to this one right here. What's the next one? And in the questions, well, you know, right? So in the questions, you know that uh, what it goes first, it's the auxiliary. In este caso, the auxiliary is the verb to be, right? So it's going to be in this way. Aquí no hay contracciones. All right, so no problem, Wilbur, and welcome to the class. Um, in, this in this case right here, um, like the, the, the auxiliary goes first. All right, so no hay contractions, and then we continue with the rest. Uh, or the, the follow, I mean, following parts of the sentence or the question in this case, in the normal way, with the going to and the complement at the end. Okay, very good, excellent. So, do you have any questions about the structure, my friends? Pregunta acerca de la structure. No question, teacher. No questions. All right, very good. Vamos a apply entonces this knowledge in un pequeño test. All right, very good. So, let's see this one right here. Pay attention to the answers, all right? So, on the first one right here, tenemos el verbo rain, all right? So, y tenemos el sujeto it. El, el, ¿Cuál es el verbo to be para el sujeto it? Sería is. Y luego vamos con going to y el verbo in the base form as that doesn't change. So, now, my friends, tell me what is going to be the one for number two. They are going to eat stew. They are, are going, are going to eat. To, no, to eat. Ah, ah, to eat. To eat is to. All right. So, very good. Excellent. So, it goes like that one. Thank you very much. So, hey, guys, I have a question for you. What is to? Estofado. Guiso. Oh, guiso, if you want to call it like that. Very good job. Excellent. So, did you go with the number three? The number three, it says I. What's the bird to be for I, my friends? I am going. I am going to Very work. Very good. I, I am going, going to, to, to work. Wow. Where? Very good. Excellent. I am going to wear blue shoes tonight. Excellent. All right. So then you continue with the next one right here, which is this one. So it says, we, it's negative. Uh, we are not going to help you. Very good. So we can say are not, or we can say aren't to help you. going to help you. I'm going to make it a little bit slow, uh, smaller, so you can see this one right here. Okay. We are not or aren't going to help you. So uh, remember, you, you, you... Mm -hmm. there. Y que be esta opción o puede ser esta opción, cualquiera de las dos formas está ok. It's ok. All right. Yes, Mr. Eh, Edmundo, tell me. No, the U is so, is, is, is there. The U. Ah, that's, that's true, that's true. All right. So, no worries. I'm going to poner aquí este, este parche. All right. So, that's ok. So, tell me. What's about number five? Yeah, isn't, isn't going to. No, isn't going to. Isn't going, going to. Isn't going to work. Isn't going. And the thing happens right here. You can say, is not, not or isn't going to walk. Go to walk. Walk. All right. So, and we continue with the next one here. There you go. It's not or isn't going to walk. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Now we have a question, right? What is going to be the question here? If the auxiliary here is going to, and the subject is you. So? Are you? Very good. Excellent. So, are you? Are you going to cook? Are you going to cook dinner, cook. right? Excellent. So, that's actually how you say it. Very good. Excellent. So now, do you have any questions, my friend? No question. Okay. Thank you. What about number seven? Number seven says right now here, Sue is, 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 is going to chill. 
Very no, good, excellent. So, teasing, going to chair. Her biscuit. biscuit. Very okay. good job. Her biscuit. Excellent. Yes. Okay. Then we have number eight. Number eight, it's a question. And the subject are, is are they? Again. Very good, excellent. So, it's going to be, are they, obviously, they going, going to live? Excellent. To live. Oops. To leave the house. Okay. Very easy. good. Excellent. Easy, easy. Then easy. we go with number nine. Number nine, it's also a question. Is she, is she going to take a part in the, in the contest? Is she, is she going to take part? Is she in going to take part? Oops. In yeah, the right. In the contest. Uh huh. Very good. Mm -hmm. And the number ten. Number ten. It says it's negative. By the way. I am not. I'm not going to spend. Yeah. 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 That's the right one, right? It says like I. Isn't. Um. No. No. Isn't. I am not. No. Isn't. Going. Going. Okay, isn't. ¿Qué me está diciendo isn't ahí? Recuerden que el Ethan, Ethan sería nada más para él, ella o eso. En ah, este okay. caso, hablando de I, que sería yo, entonces ahí usamos am. Sería I am not going to. ¿Cuál es el verbo que tenemos acá? Spend. Spend. Very good. Oops. <coughs> ok, teacher. All right. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Very good, my friends. You were doing a very good job on this one right here. All right, so do you have any questions so far uh, about the pronunciation of this one? Yes no, or no? No, teacher. No, okay, teacher. Excellent. So, well, right now, my friends, we are going to, uh, let me just stop sharing here. And we are going to go with the new thing here. One second. There you go, excellent. I'm loading this right now. All right, excellent. Yo sé que, you know, it's Friday, right? Competitions. Let's see here. All right, all right, excellent, my friends. Ahí tenemos este game, right? So, Vamos a ver entonces here, all right, who is going to be here, the winner, and who's going to be participating, of course, right, on this one. Ahorita vamos a ver who is going to participate, in what order. I just want to check attendance before we continue, okay? So, let me see. Adrián Iglesias? Present, teacher. Thank you. I am here. Okay, so no, Ellen Nielsen. There you go, excellent. So, um, Carlos Alberto Santos. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Edgardo Cruz. Present teacher. All right, excellent. So, David Antonio Rosales. David, not here. Very good, excellent. So let's continue. Edith Consuelo Represa. Edith, Edith, Edith. Okay, All right, very good. Edmundo Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you, Enrique Perez. Not here. Erika Beatriz. Not here. Eh, Ever Enriquez. Eh, perdón, Ever Enrique Gallegos. Sorry. Yes, it's connected. All right. So, Franklin de la O. Very good. Yes. Thank you. Present teacher. Hey, Present teacher. Present teacher. Thank you. Present, Franklin. Okay. Eh, Jose Benjamin. All right, Juan Francisco, si participó al principio. All 
right, so thank you. Eh, Magdalena, que tenemos el sonido. Mónica y Bet, all right. Enrique, Santos, Santos, Santos. Arias, yes. All right, Saúl Martínez. Present, Mauricio Arias. Wilber Rivas. Carnero. Present teacher. Yeah, What? Teacher. You got a nickname? All right, so, well, everybody here. So let's just go ahead and check what is going to be here. Veamos, according to this one, ¿quién podría here, sir, like this one? Veamos. We're going to uh, start right here. One quick second. So, veamos, ¿quiénes van a participar here actively? Mm -hmm. All right, excellent. So we go here. All right. Vamos a ir ver. Uh, this one we are going to be accumulating only one thing here. Seems we're gonna all everybody here is going to participate, right? So vamos a hacer un solo team y a ver si acumulan puntos or not. All right. So let's see. Let's see this one right here. All right. Who wants to be the first volunteer, my friend? Yes, volunteer, volunteer for this one. Who's going to be the first one? Me, teacher. Me, teacher. Me, teacher. Okay. Uh, raise your hand, please, on the, on the, um, here. It says, okay, Edmundo, and I guess the second one was Wilbur, right? Okay, Edmundo, you start. Do you know how it works, right? You select the category and then how many points you want to. Mm, make it negative. Make it negative. How many points do you want, my friend? 500. Excellent. All right. We are going to fly to Cartagena next week. How would you say that in negative? They are not going to fly to Cartagena next week. Let's see if that is correct. They are not. Well, they said they are not. This is aren't, but it's the same. You know, the contraction, it actually doesn't make a difference in the sentence, right? So, yes. Thank you. 500 points. Let's just continue with this one. Very good. Then, uh, let's continue with the next one. Uh, Wilbur, I guess, is not the volunteer. Go ahead, my friend. Uh, number one, teacher. Number It's one from work. what category? 200. But what category? This one? Yes, the third. Okay, 200? Yes, teacher. Okay. What's the mistake? Mm -hmm. Ahí está preguntando que si ella tiene un, un bebé, ¿verdad? No, well, ¿qué era la categoría? Veamos. Well, what's the category? ¿Está correcta o incorrecta? That's actually what you have to say. Correct or incorrect? Incorrect, teacher. Para what she is the is, mistake? She? He is, este, is. Very good. Is. So, está incorrecta, right? So, it's supposed to be she is, which is going to be this one right here, all right? So, it's supposed to change that one. Thank you, my friend. Really appreciate it. All right, so let's continue here. I'm going to those 200 points. There we go. Thank you. All right, any other participant? Volunteer, volunteer? Yes? Yeah, teacher. Okay, Maria, tell me, what category? Huh, Magdalena, what category? Four mm. hundred. But, but what category? Correct or incorrect? Um, mm. Will be or going to? The question. Questions. Two hundred. This one. Two hundred. Okay. Will it rain on Wednesday? ¿Cómo sería la respuesta si la respuesta es negativa? 
La pregunta es, will it rain on Wednesday? Y aquí dice, no, no que sería ahí. It will be no what. Mm. Mm. María, María. Hello? Oh, she's gone. Anybody else who can help me with the answer? Yep. Hello, hello. Estamos pensando la respuesta, teacher. Está complicadita. Nah, aquí está la pregunta. Let's, this one. La pregunta ya está hecha aquí. All right. Aquí la respuesta dice que no. Ahora me tienen ustedes que dar esta parte que hace falta. No que. ¿Cómo se responde? No, I, I will. No, porque no estamos hablando de yo, all right, como I. Este, sino de like, um, eat, all right. So, entonces ahí sería. Yes. Teacher, este, excuse me, uh, el it es pero porque se refiere al día, ¿verdad? No es porque se refiere a él. Ajá, más que el día, que le, al hecho de llover, all right? So, yes. Teacher, the answer is negative. The answer is negative, ajá. ¿Cómo sería entonces? Oh, it will not rain. It will not rain, vamos a ver. One second. Mm. No, it won't. All right. So, okay. la respuesta que usted dio de it will not rain está correctísima. It's correct. Ok, no worries. You did a good job. Esa nada más es una respuesta corta. All right. So, en lugar, por ejemplo, de tener acá el, um, what it says, like, it will not rain, que es lo que tenemos acá, sería it will not rain. All right. So, we got this one there. Tenemos entonces aquí what it says. All right, hey, what happens? Sorry. It, the future. Thanks. It will not rain. Es lo que usted dijo, right? It will not rain. Entonces, esta de acá, so this one right here is exactly a esto. Okay. All right. Así que it's the same thing. La única difference es que aquí nos pide de la forma abreviada, la forma corta, para que diga uno want. Understand? But yes, so we got the points right there. Thank you. Okay, very good. Excellent. Uh huh. Anybody else who wants to help with a different category? Huh? Hello, hello, different category. Herbert, Herbert Aristides. And participate, please, please. Correcta e incorrecta, teacher. Veamos cómo me va. Correct or incorrect. Let's see. Veamos. Uh, I found there three. 300. 300. Oh my God. This one. Oh, this I one. Yes, yes. Okay. I feel really tired. I think I will go to bed. My friend, this is correct or incorrect. Tell me. I feel a bit really tired in the good way. Incorrecta. Incorrecta. Are you sure? Completely sure? Incorrecta, teacher. Incorrecta. So let's see what does it says. It's correct. It's correct. I feel really correct. tired. It's Exactly. It is correct. I feel really tired. I think I will go to bed. Exactly. Says, I will go to bed. Okay. That's correct. Okay, that cool. oh, yes. Ah. Mm. Thank you. No, no worries. No worries. All right. Estamos los puntos entonces. All right. So good. Let's see. What's the next one, my friends? Next volunteer for this one. Please, 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 please. Mm -hmm. Repetition yes. in, ¿se puede, teacher? Démosle. 
Hey, what's up, Saul? You don't want to participate, huh? <laughs> okay. Making negative, teacher. Making negative. Magdalena, how many points? Mm, Three hundred. <laughs> Three hundred. He is going to buy a new car. Negative, Magdalena. Wow, no car. He's going. He's correct. Yes, but you have to make it negative. Is um, so la misma la misma oración buy. but negative. He is he he's, he isn't going to buy a new car. Okay, so it will be. Yeah, much. He is going to buy a new car. Okay, let's see. This one. He isn't going to buy a new car. Is that correct? Vamos a ver qué dice aquí the answer. Yes. He isn't going to buy a new car. Excellent, Magdalena. That's the correct one right there. Thank you very much. Recuperamos los 300 points. All right. Okay. Good job, good job, good job. Thank you. So let's just continue with the next one right here. Okay. Very good, very good, very good. There you go. Aha, Saul, your turn. Talk my friend. Go ahead. Come on, Mr. Saul. Let it go. Parquiera, my friend, no worries. My friend. Will all be going to mm -hmm. make it make I need it. practice saying I need for me. <laughs> yes, please. What is it? Uh -huh. Saul? Category yeah. one, two, three, four, or five. Five. Yes, yes, yes. Five. Two hundred. Okay. The category number five sería aquí. Uh, five. Let me see. The category number five seria one, two, three, four, five. We're talking about this one, making negative, right? Making negative, 200. Yes. Okay, very good. Tell me, my friend, I will put on the air conditioning. Dice acá la question, all right? Okay. So what's the negative? Yes. Uh, will I put on the air condition? It's negative. Make it negative. Oh my God. Yes. Um, negative, negative, solo negative. I will. Okay. 
this and join the first day and line up this way. I very good, very good, very good. What's the answer, my friend? I won't put on the idle condition. I won't put it here. On the right? idle condition. All right, very good, very good. Excellent. Sria, I want, correct? I won't. I want. All right, very good. Excellent. Thank you. Vamos a ver qué dice aquí. I want, like that one. Okay. I will put on a conditioner. Excellent. Oh my very God. good. We got this one. Thank you, my friend. Yes. All right. Let's continue here. Anybody else? Me, teacher. Thank you, Go ahead. Go for another one for 500. Uh, correct. Correct the error. The first five, one. No, five. Yes. Yeah. Correct okay. wrong, 500. Would you prefer to your coffee? I am going to have some coffee, please. Correct. Correct. So you're saying correct. Let's see here. This is, I will have some coffee, please. Oh. Why? 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 Uh-huh. Why is but it? But it, but it, but it, but it uh, the question. Ah, would. Yes. I will have some mm, coffee. Please. Exactly. This is just, just, just because you're using wood. Yes. All right. Yes. All right. I'll have some coffee. It's basically but, uh, because uh, you are ordering. When you know oh, yeah. an order, when you place an order, but normally you use will. I will have a. Okay. I will have. Yes. I will have. I will have a. Exactly. But, but right? The extension in this sentences is correct. Yes. I mean, it's you correct. Prefer. Of course, yeah. it's absolutely correct. Okay. Yeah. This is absolutely correct. Uh, the, the, the only thing here que test hace referencia a is que estamos hablando de una um, well, when you're going to order food. Order right? food. So, exactly. Yeah. That's why they it's prefer or it's more common to say I will have. All right. Yeah. So, but as I said before, no, es que no va a entender si usted usa going to, of course, right? But yes. the, gram, the grammatically, I mean, the grammar topic that is supposed to be used here is will. But yeah, you're right. The structure, it's okay as well. No worries. Okay. Thank you, thank you. All right, all right, all right. There you go, there you go. Okay, and now, my friends, let's just continue here. Thank you, my friends, for helping me with this one. Okay, okay, so let's just go here. And we are going to go on this one, all right? Now, but I need to participate, my friends, because here, sometimes you don't participate. Okay, así que pilas todo el mundo para que vayamos quickly. Solo son, you know, a couple of questions here. Okay, excellent. Very good, very good. Oops. Go to chat. Oh, here it is. Very good, excellent. Everybody, let's just join that one right here. Please. There you go. Excellent, excellent. Very good. So let's see this one. I already have two people here, Edmundo and Wilbur. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Continue, my friend. Continue, my friends. There you go, there you go, everybody. Metámonos, metámonos. Access with the L, with Saul. So we can continue right now, all right? Very good, very good. Excellent. So there you go, there you go. Tenemos five people que ya están aquí. Mundo. Vamos a ver, 10 questions, and then we finish, my friends. Very good. Excellent, excellent. Thank you very much. Uh -huh, that's excellent. Good job. You're in the mundo. Good job. What happens with the rest? We have more. Edit. Three correct ones in a row. Oh my God, my God. Len. One. Uh, 
Time's up, time's up, time's up, time's up. Very good, very good. Excellent. There you go, there you go. In time's up, time's up. All right, so let's see what happens right here. All right, so excellent. Adam, Edmundo, and Wilbur got the first place. Very good job, my friend. Excellent. Thank you very much this one. All right, excellent, everybody here. So you see, we have practiced uh, different grammar topics today. All right, so uh, regarding simple future, no problem, Carlos Santos, no problem, okay? So, my friends, we are going to stop right here because the class is over, but I just want to say thank you very much for joining the class. Have a nice weekend, and see you on Monday. Bye-bye. Take care, teacher. Have you a nice too. weekend. Have a nice see weekend. See you next month. Have Bye. a nice weekend. Have thank a nice weekend. you, likewise. Bye-bye, teacher. Bye-bye, Magdalena. Take care. Good night. Sweet dreams, Bye -bye. everybody. Take care, my friend.